local restaurants benefited from loans and relief at the start of the pandemic. Now the money for small business has run dry and owners are left to figure out how they can stay open. Nine News reporter Mark Salinger shows us the help they're asking for. The street in front of Duo Restaurant in the Highlands is quiet these days. COVID has taken so much joy out of our lives and the restaurant industry is no different. The outdoor dining tables are locked up for the winter. The front door is closed to customers. And inside, owner Stephanie Bonin weighs the reality that help may not be coming. Small businesses don't have deep pockets to be able to bounce back from situations like this. A year ago, her restaurant employed 22 people. Now they're down to a team of nine doing takeout orders, losing money every day they stay open. We're living it, we're reacting to it, and we're saying very clearly, we need help. Duo received a PPP loan in the spring. That money came and went. Nine months into the pandemic and only one $1,200 stimulus check later, She's pleading with the federal government to help. The petition she started on change.org now has nearly 2 million signatures. Petition asked for $2,000 a month ongoing through the pandemic. When it comes to what they talk about as relief, is a band-aid for a gaping wound. In Lafayette, Lillian Lieb and her mother Jules are also struggling. They've owned Morning Glory Cafe for the past nine years. They also got PPP loans, but like Duo in Denver, that money is gone. I can't even express to you the emotional drain that that has on me as a business owner. The Liebs have had to let go of nearly two thirds of their staff since the pandemic began. You can't employ people when you don't have any sales. And right now, our sales are a third, a, a fifth, maybe even a tenth of what they were before. Restaurants have had to close their doors to diners before during this pandemic. They're saying you need to do the same thing again, but we don't have any help to offer you yet. This time, they're left wondering if the help will ever come. In Denver, I'm Mark Salinger, 9 News. The Colorado State Legislature passed a series of bills this week aimed at helping small businesses and those who are unemployed. Still, restaurant owners say they need more help.